Hi, I'm Mona Dalal and today I'm going to show you Nutella chocolate chip and sea salt cookies. It's one of my favorite cookies and I would love all of you to try them and give me your feedback. Okay, now we let's begin making our cookies. First take soft butter, put it in a pan and we melt it lightly until it's light brown. As soon as the butter melts, you'll see a light foam and then you can shut the gas and transfer it into a bowl. Keep an eye so the butter doesn't burn. The melted butter gives a lovely taste to our cookies. Keep it on a medium flame. As soon as you see it boiling a little bit and see the foam on top, as you can see it here, it's time to turn off the gas. This would take approximately four to five minutes. As you can see, the foam is appearing on top. Keep stirring until it's light brown. As you can see, it's turned light brown and we can see the foam on top. Transfer this into a bowl and let it cool. Now we let's begin making our flour mixture, plain flour baking soda, this is brown sugar, normal granulated sugar. Mix your flour mixture. And keep it aside. Our flour mixture is ready. We keep it aside. We need the butter to cool completely, which would take approximately five to seven minutes. As you can see, the butter is light brown. This is the key to the cookies, which would give a lovely flavor to it. The melted golden brown butter. The butter is finely cooled down. To this, you add one full egg, one egg yolk, vanilla essence, and thick curd. Mix lightly. Add the flour mixture to the butter and mix to make a dough. Also put in the chopped chocolate. Use your hand and mix all the ingredients. Also add in the chocolate chips and mix to make a dough. Knead the dough well. You don't need to make it into a round dough. Just mix it well, cover it with a cling wrap and either put it in the freezer for approximately half an hour or in the refrigerator for two hours. So we've got the cookie dough ready from the chiller after 30 minutes. You need the cookie dough to be a little cold when you're making and rolling out the cookies. And this is Nutella. We've got one tablespoon of Nutella put in the plate and chilled in the refrigerator for about half an hour too. So it's nice and hard when you're rolling your cookies. This dough would approximately give you about 24 cookies. So you can start making about 24 balls. Just flatten the cookie, put in your Nutella and close it. You don't need to flatten it, you can just leave it as a round shape. We make our first batch of the cookies. We put 12 cookies in this tray and when we put it in the oven, the cookies will melt and it will become a little bigger. So have sufficient space between your cookies. Bake it in a preheated oven at 180 degrees for about 10 to 12 minutes and you will see that the cookies turn a little brown on the edges. So do take it out and see that they don't get burnt. So we've got our cookies out of the oven. Let's sprinkle some sea salt. Sprinkle it as soon as it comes out of the oven so it sticks on to the cookies. and allow the cookies to cool down completely before you touch them. 
cookies here which have finally cooled down. Let me break a piece and show you the Nutella. Do try them and give us your feedback. Download the Tala Dalal app on your Apple and Android devices. Follow us on the Facebook at taladalal.com. If you enjoy our recipes, click like. To see more of my recipes, click here. Please share your comments. I would love to hear them. I'm waiting for them.